welcome back to the channel. I don't know if you're going to be able to hear me very good because it's a bit windy. Um, thanks for clicking on the video. So today I'm in the Peak District and I'm doing my first ever wild camp and I'm glad you're coming along to join me. So what I'm going to do, I'm planning on walking up to Free Shire's Head which is over there somewhere so hopefully I can walk up to there and depending on time I want to see if I can walk back to Axe Edge Moor doing my camp on there but like I said I'll see how we are for time and and whatnot so yeah thanks for coming along and I'll see you at Free Shires peace out guys It's not goes to plan because it's a long walk home. Mental considering I only live technically down the road from here and I've never been before in my life. It's totally amazing. Well, right, so I'm going to carry on. I'll catch you a bit, guys. <laughs> Shire's head now. What a walk. So basically, um, the Dave Valley Way where I should come down is waterlogged and I can't get through. So I've had to come, I've basically had to go back on myself, come across and through the longer way. And now it's what, three o'clock now? So I don't know whether it's to stay here, find this pitch. That's here, right next to the River Dave. So, so yeah, I think I might just pitch up here to be honest with you. Well, I won't pitch up yeah, I'll until it gets a bit later then pitch up. Alright, I'll catch you a bit, I'm gonna get my breath back. Whew. See you in a bit guys.
hope you enjoyed that little time up here. Um, I'm going to get set up here, get out there, have the wind a little bit. It's not too windy, but it's a bit nippy. That's why I put the, the good old bobble hat on to keep my head warm. Um, my ears warm because I'm deaf, and if my ears get cold, it's sort of irritating. So, but yeah, I'm going to get set up here. I won't show you that bit. It's using the Coleman Darwin 2 Plus, what was gifted to me by somebody on the Great Outdoors TV Facebook group. So whoever you were, thank you. Ted's being used today. So yeah, I'll catch you in a minute guys, I'll set up and talk through what I've got with me. I haven't got loads of them, but you know, it's just part of the fun. Alright, I'll catch you in a minute guys, peace. Alright guys, it's the tent all set up. We should get in and start unpacking the stuff. I'll catch you in a minute. Alright guys. It's here, I'm all set up, bed sorted, um, just going to chill for a bit now. Um, the sleeping bag I'm using is on right there. Um, it's got a comfort rating of 10, the limit is 0 degrees, then extremes minus 10. It's not going to go minus 10 tonight anyway. Yeah, I've just got uh, a cheap bag here. Self inflating mat, and I got some um, treats. So, for my tea, I'm just having a pot noodle. Just, you know, plain old chicken mushroom pot noodle. That's it. And a nice little bottle of red. I'd go with that. Um, Soundwave IPA. Very tasty. That is. 5.6% and the next one is a recommendation by Mr. Dave Outdoors himself it's a pineapple milkshake one I'm going to try that as well today so yeah that's it guys I'm just going to chill out for a bit and I'll come back to you when I'm puking my tea and whatnot I'll catch you in a bit guys peace Just had a walk down to the waterfalls. Have a look around before I lose all the light. I got. Well, I'm enjoying myself so far. Um, I'm pretty glad actually, and I stopped because I was getting rather tired. Like I said, it was waterlogged, and I just couldn't get through. Or else I would have got here a lot earlier, and I would have had time to get back up to. Axe Edge more, but it's a nice location this is, so I'll be happy here. I'm going to try and find some signal just so I can contact my wife to tell her I'm alright. She hasn't seen off me since about one o'clock, so, so yeah, go down to the waterfalls. I'll take some shots down there and I'll show you them, and I'll catch you in a bit guys. Peace.
out guys, I'm back at the tent. I managed to get a text through to her. It's all that I love to do, like I always do. Which means everything to me. <sighs> feels always, always feels strange not being around her, to be honest with me. Anyway, time for a beer. I'm going to try this one. Um, recommended by Dave, Dave, Dave Outdoors. I'll put the link in the description for his channel. So yeah, this one's for you mate. Sounds good. I smell that pineapple. Wow. Ooh. David, you naughty boy. You've been hiding this one for a while, haven't you? It's nice, this is. That's up to you, mate. That's good, isn't that? Oh, dear. I never know what to say on my videos. And I always struggle talking to people, a bit shy, you see. So I thought I'd just tell you a little bit about myself, just make a conversation. And basically, I'm 29, um, I turn 30 next month. Um, I was born in a stoke. I haven't got the, the, the best job in the world, I'm a supervisor for the weeks. Yeah, the work store, the bookshop. Some people may have heard of them. I've um, been there for coming up to five years. Um, I've been supervising nearly three. Um, I got married in 2018. Um, just for my wife. Um, we've been together since I was um, 18. So it's like 12 years or something like that. Um, I had my first child at 16. Um, God, she's just turned 13. I had one at 18, then one at 25. Uh, it's not really much to name, might be. <laughs> I'm not that exciting, <laughs> to be honest with you. Um, but yeah. Uh, yeah. So anyway, I'm going to drink this amazing beer, chill out for a bit, I've got a couple of shout outs, um, ooh to shout outs, obviously I've just shouted out Dave Outdoors because of the, the beer, um, I think the one person I want to give a shout out to is um, Billy at Billy's Little Big Adventures. Um, he always has conversation with me when I'm when I post and stuff. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd give Billy a shout out. Really nice person, in all honesty. So I'll pop a, a link for his channel in the description as well. And good morning guys. It's half past five. Jesus. Slept all right. Wind stayed off. I slept all right when I gave up caring about how I was sleeping where I was. I'll get up now, have a brew. Got back here. Made my way back to Buxton for a quarter past nine hours, I think. Oh. Oh. Catch you a bit, guys. There we are, guys. I'm all packed up now. Just remember, leave no trace. Doesn't even look like I've been here. Alright, I'll catch you in a minute, guys. There we have it guys, first wild camp done, 
glad to say I'm still alive. I feel like I proper achieved something by doing it. It's a good night into all this gavvy. Went to sleep about eight o'clock. Unusual for me. <laughs> um, yeah, so I just want to thank you for joining me on this journey. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. And yeah, I hope you all have amazing adventures. Till next time, bye.